Hi DSST students and families. I hope you're taking care of yourself and doing okay in this difficult time. This Friday, March 27th, DSST is going to take the first steps into eSchool and begin moving into online learning. We're going to ease our way into it by having a meeting with your advisory teacher on Friday. If there are any technical issues, email us at student.helpdesk at scienceandtech.org. I'm going to show you three simple steps you need to follow to join your advisory meeting on Friday. Number one, open Microsoft Teams and sign in. Number two, find your class team. And number three, join the Teams meeting. Step one, the first thing to do is open Microsoft Teams from the icon on your desktop. It will probably ask you to sign in. You just need to sign in using your school email address. Your email address is just your first name, period, last name, period, and the school abbreviation. Then the at symbol and then scienceandtech.org. Once you've typed that in, click sign in. Then it will ask you for your password. This is the same password you use when you log into your computer. That should do it. Step two, when you are in Microsoft Teams, click on the Teams button in the left menu. This will bring up all of your class teams. For now, you only need to go into your advisory class. Just click on the square. Inside your advisory class, you will see some posts. One of them will be a link that your teacher created for your meeting on Friday. It will also tell you what time the meeting is. Step three, when it's time on Friday for your meeting, double click on that post that has the meeting time. Then go to the upper right corner and click join. That takes you into the meeting and it will ask you one more time. Click join meeting and you are on your way. When you are first in the meeting, your microphone and camera will be off. There may be times when your teacher lets you turn them on. Your advisory teacher will tell you anything else you need to do in the meeting. That's all you need to know for now. There's a document that has all the same information that you can follow step by step. Families will be getting more information soon about how you can use Teams and other tools as we move into eSchool and online learning in the next few weeks. Take care of yourself, and we'll see you soon in a virtual classroom.